happy on this game, so for now you will be smart about decision making. Just clap whoever that we see. Oh my god, I didn't expect everybody over here. Damn! This bar is incredible. Bro. Oh, I got the. Wait. Okay, we went. We've gone in nuclear. That's because of the the kill streaks. Yeah. Okay, but we got like no ammo though. Okay. Ooh. Oh, no. oh my God, bro! Go get him! Go get him, bro! We got the nuke. Let's go, guys. Would you still care? So uh, what's up guys, it's here here by Nino or Quadigy and welcome back to another video of Call of Duty Vanguard. And yes, in today's video we're going to be talking about the Bar Assault Rifle here in Call of Duty Vanguard. The Bar Assault Rifle is legit one of the fastest killing guns in this game. It legit only takes one or two headshots to kill somebody and it's regularly a three shot kill to like the chest and other parts of the body. This gun is legit super po freaking powerful and I optimized it to have a super fast fire rate and really low recoil so you can beam people from far away. This is the most overpowered class setup in all of Call of Duty Vanguard and I think you guys can kind of tell from the intro clip. So if you guys are excited to see my most overpowered BAR class setup here for Call of Duty Vanguard, make sure you guys drop a like, subscribe if you're new, and turn on those post notifications. We're on the road to a thousand subscribers here on the More Carnage Hero channel. And like I said before, I'll be uploading Vanguard like crazy when this game finally comes out. And you guys will be seeing nothing but the best entertainment and content in Call of Duty multiplayer. Uh, before Vanguard comes out, you know, after the beta, we'll be, you know, posting Cold War multiplayer. And then once Vanguard comes out, you know, Vanguard will be out here. So yeah, make sure you guys stay tuned to the channel. But yeah, without further ado, let's go ahead and show off this class setup. So as you guys all know, we got our 10 best attachments here. I don't recommend running a, re a magazine though, so I guess it'll be a nine attachment class. So just, just uh, with the level cap that's currently in place, there's just no good magazine that you should use. This, you only have 12 rounds in your mag, which is not good. And then with this eight millimeter Jaeger 20 round mags, it just lowers the damage of this gun, which is one of the, its, its best qualities. So just don't use either of these. Uh, in the future, whenever this game is completely out, I would say maybe the 30 round mag right here is worth it but even then i would say no mag is probably your best bet but yeah that's what i've been rocking so yeah let's go through all the attachments so we got our first muzzle being the recoil booster which allows us to have a faster fire rate at just a little bit cost of accuracy the bar has a very slow fire rate so by making that fire rate even faster this gun will melt even faster which is completely overpowered for our next attachment we got the barrel of the cooper 21 precision which gives us bullet velocity damage does not diminish over range and ads speed but we lose some recoil control and don't worry about the recoil control we'll take care of that later but this gun will have bullet velocity which means that long range this gun came out quickly its damage does not diminish over range which means that it's gonna hit hard no matter what it's gonna be a three shot kill from any part of the map it's gonna be a two shot headshot kill from any part of the map that makes it super overpowered and then with the ads speed you can ads uh, really quickly to get the jump on a point so this is an overpowered attachment bro it's, it's insane for our optic we got the zeiss g16 2.5x which is basically like the VLK from Modern Warfare 2019. This is one of the best scopes in the game, and I definitely recommend it. So definitely put it on, especially for that recoil control. For our stock, we have the Chariot WR. And with this, we get accuracy, recoil control, flinch resistance, and aiming stability. So whatever cons we had by running the barrel when it comes to recoil control, we pretty much made it all back with this attachment, which is absolutely insane. We're gonna be extremely accurate, we won't be missing shots, and this gun won't be too heavy either because, uh, you know, we, we're losing some movement speed in ADS speed, but other attachments are gonna make up for that. And this gun still feels like a laser beam across range. You'll see in the gameplay how crazy this gun is. For our under barrel, we have the Carver Forward Grip, which gives us recoil control and hit fire accuracy. We need that recoil control once again to make this gun a laser beam because it's gonna have a lot of uh, recoil loss from one of the attachments, but uh, we're getting it back. And then hit fire accuracy is always good for certain situations, just like that double headshot I got in the intro clips. For your ammo type, you wanna run subsonic because this allows you to pretty much stay 
stay off the minimap from enemies, uh, you know, you know, lines of sight. So this allows you to be a lot more sneaky on the map, which is very key in this game. And then for our rear grip, we have rubber grip, which gives us recoil control. We just need that extra recoil control to make this gun a laser beam. For our proficiency, we're gonna be using discard, which makes us reload faster if we have run out of ammo, which is really nice. And then for our kit, we just have surplus to get additional XP. This doesn't really matter for anything. But later on, we'll probably use one of the other attachments. But yeah, this is the 10 attachment class setup or the 9 attachment class setup that you gotta run on the BAR here in Call of Duty Vanguard. I legit have the easiest time ever on Vanguard, and I don't feel like anybody can outgun me unless uh, I don't expect them or they're camping me or whatever the case is. This gun will kill anything faster than you can say I. It, it is legit insane how overpowered the BAR is. So yeah. Uh, if you guys end up using this class, if you guys end up being very successful, make sure you guys drop a like, subscribe if you and turn on those notifications. And comment down in the comment section below what Vanguard gun I should use next on the beta. I know the uh, the level cap just got increased, so I gotta do some leveling. And what what guns should I use next? Just let me know in the comment section below. But yeah, uh, what's your currently your favorite gun in Vanguard? I want to say for me right now, it's the BAR. So I would say use this gun incredibly. It, it's, it's beautiful. But yeah. You guys are going to be seeing a nice little V2 Rocket gameplay that I got, as you guys saw from the intro clips, and I hope you guys enjoy. Thank you for just, just being a beautiful audience and blessing me every single day. So, yeah, I'll see you guys on the next one, but for now, enjoy this BAR gameplay. I freaking love you all. Enjoy. Okay, so uh, what's up, guys? Here we're here, Binding or Quadrant. Today, we'll be playing some Call of Duty Vanguard multiplayer. Today, we're rock and rolling with the BAR. I have it at max level, and this gun is a legit broken gun it, it melts like crazy fast and it's pretty much my favorite assault rifle in this game i have it maxed out and you guys will see that it just kills fast this gun is no joke at what it does so hopefully we can uh have a fun time here and body anybody that gets in our way as long as i don't be choking shots out here because right now it's amazing Oh my god, okay, we get that STG now. Anybody around? Okay, we just gotta hold it down everywhere. Put this down and then see what we can do right here. This is where I got my first nuke, because this is legit the best map in the game. Holy crap, hold on. They're looking for me, bro. Save me? Well, save me then. Use the doors to your advantage, by the way. The doors in this game for a reason, you know? Come on, bro. Okay. Oh, yep. He made knows what's up, bro. I'm telling you. You got to adapt to the nature of this game, and the nature of this game is to camp. One way or another, bro. One thing that sucks is this dude kind of took the spot I want to be at, and he just broke the door. Get the fuck out of here, bro. Come on, bro. No, no, no. Please, 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 please. Come, dogs. Save me, bro. Y'all gotta do something, bro. Please be good, doggies. Okay, this is bad. This is bad. This is bad. Okay, we're alive. Oh, my God. Okay, we're safe. Yeah, we're safe. My goodness, guys. Everywhere, bro. We gotta flip again. Let's move over here. Oh, there's a dude right here. Hold on. Yeah, I'm just trying to play it really smart, guys. And I'm trying to use the bar as much as possible, so. Come on, bro. Give me. Give me. Give me. Okay, we good. Wait, the enemies got a dog? Or they killed him? I guess he just killed him. Okay, we're good. We're safe. Go ahead, move ahead. Just play it smart again. I like how my character, like, chews on my dogs. I think it's kind of cute. Like, another one? Good girl. Just push, just push, push, push. Okay. okay, teammates got it. Teammates got it. Okay, we could do this, bro. We can get this nuke. I know we can. Right here. Okay, got another field mic. 
All I gotta do is just hold it down. Wait for my teammates to kind of die. Or legit let me die, I guess. Teammates move, bro. We're in a bad spot here, bro. Telling my UAV. There's a dude on B. Yeah, we could drop this nuke, guys. I'm telling you. You gotta play campy on this game, guys. I'm sorry if my nukes are hella campy on this game, but it legit is just the nature of the game. This game just isn't really rush friendly. Oh my god. I fucked up. I fucked up. I fucked up. I fucked up. Okay, there we go. There we go. It's all positioning at this point, guys. Come on, bro. Can we get B or something? We're moving this way now. Which I don't want to be moving this way because I'm probably going to die to something stupid right now. Okay, we can move slowly here, right? Yeah, we're moving slowly. Losing objective <gasps> we got the nuke! Let's go, guys. I don't know what kind of kill streak I'm on right now, but we're not calling this nuke for a minute, bro. We can keep this nuke streak going. Holy crap. Kind of wish they had the, the, nu the nuke medals or the unstoppable medals counted at the end of the game. But you make sure you guys drop a like, subscribe, when you turn on those post notifications. <laughs> this is crazy. And we're still going too. I just wish kill streaks loop too, man. I get a bunch of kills right now. We're just getting the unstoppable medals for, you know, a flex at this point. I freaking love Vanguard when everything goes my way for once. Oh, well, I just died. Well, let's try to get a double nuke, but let me know what you guys think about the BAR. Hopefully this nuke was a lot more exciting than the, uh, the other one that I had, but yeah, just, just use debate BAR. It's the strongest gun in this game. It legit kills people in like three shots. It's incredible. Domination going, bro. Nope. Well, let's try to get dropped this 100 plus kill game as well. Oh. Bro, don't tell me this game's about to end. I just dropped a nuke, bro. <sighs> no, please don't end. Please don't end. Oh my god. Hey, I got 67 kills. I got like a really high kill streak. That's gonna be the video. If uh, this doesn't fucking come back. That's just how it goes on Vanguard. It's a beta, man. You know, we gotta, we gotta. It is what it is at this point. I would have been awesome to hear the reaction that maybe I should have ended the game. And now my entire game is frozen. Anyways, make sure you guys drop a like, subscribe if you're new, and turn on those notifications. Let me know what you guys think about the Vanguard beta so far. And what you guys think about the BAR here in Vanguard. Three shot kill weapon, two shots to the head, maybe even a one shot headshot. It's overpowered. I'll be using with the class setup that I provided for you guys and you'll have a very, very fun time. So yeah, follow me over on Twitch under TikTok at the Mark of a Hero. And, uh, you know, keep supporting this channel. Multiplayer videos will definitely commence on this channel as much as possible. But yeah, I freaking love you all. Have you ever been, have you ever had a nuke and been lagged out and you can call in your nuke in? Let me know in, in any call, dude. Anyways, <laughs> bye guys. I love you all. I need you.